What's going on guys? Welcome to my channel, Stick Shift Hot Wheels, for another casting comparisons video. Today we have the 1949 Volkswagen Beetle pickup, which is a 2019 new model. I'm comparing it with the 1989 casting of the VW Bug. This VW Bug comes from the 1995 Pearl Driver series. And uh, this new VW pickup, uh, I think, is very interesting. It's kind of, uh, it's different for Hot Wheels. And I was very curious to see how both of these castings compared because there is quite a lot of differences. And honestly, I'm kind of shocked in the difference in scale as well. 89 version, you know, has the larger rear wheel and just kind of has a... Uh, a hunkered down stance in the front and the new pickup you know is a little bit lifted just slightly and you know has the same size wheels and tires in the front and the rear um, but what I wasn't expecting was uh, the front half of the vehicle the hood area is definitely looks different um, it looks larger on this new casting interesting to say the least um, you know, this is obviously Hot Wheels cost cutting, but the new version, you know, has a plastic base versus a metal base on the older casting. And that's kind of a shame because the metal bumpers on the older casting look way better. So the 1949 Volkswagen pickup is based off of the 1942 Beetle commercial. And these pickups were used during World War II by the German army. They're the only factory VW Beetle based pickup trucks. So it's kind of a unique casting. Uh, it's kind of cool that Hot Wheels is making it into a parts truck. It has a matte finish. I don't know, the matte finishes are not, it's not exactly 100% consistent. You know, I looked at three or four of these and each one looked slightly different. So I assume that the paint is, you know, kind of a clear frosted paint that's going over the metal it hasn't been applied very evenly there's definitely spots on the casting where it could have used more paint the interior of the bed sides and along the creases of the fenders the matte paint is really noticeable when you get it next to you know a car with a pearl or metallic finish um, the contrast between the two is significant the original casting uses the metal base for the headlights and I prefer that. Um, trying to find the newer car with the headlight tampos lined up correctly was impossible. I've been seeing this more and more but the casting itself on the old car seems like it has deeper indentations for the doors and for the stamp of the hood and the lines and various details. Uh, the new casting, the hood, is kind of a complete disappointment. That character line running down the center is kind of the trademark look for the VW Beetle. I think the proportions of this casting were pretty much dead on. It looks like the real thing. The stance looks pretty good, even though it's not 100% correct, I would say. But for kind of a custom Hot Wheels vehicle, I think that looks pretty nice. And honestly, this Pearl Driver car looks awesome awesome in this pearl pink it really shimmers and has an awesome depth to it the original car has a small half window on the doors and the new one does not so i don't know if that's hot those cost cutting this is an awesome new casting something unusual that has an interesting bit of history thank you for watching my channel stick shift hot wheels please like and subscribe to my channel for more Hot Wheels videos. You may also like these related Hot Wheels videos. Have a great day!